So when there's a divorce in the family, it's difficult in itself. The children need to be aware that mom and dad are not gonna be living in the same home environment any longer, but it doesn't mean that they are not loved. It doesn't mean that things will change drastically. So usually the first steps is for parents to be able to communicate between themselves and say, you know, you're gonna be living in a different home, I'm gonna be living in my home, and our children is gonna be living with you 50% of the time, and it's gonna be living with me 50% of the time. Not always is possible for adults to be on the same page because they have their own parenting style, but whenever parents try to do the best that they can to remain consistency in both homes, when it comes to discipline, when it comes to strategies, if parents can agree on those terms, the children are gonna feel and they're gonna be able to do a lot better. Children remain very egocentric, which means that as much as they are seeking attention, um, they're also feeling guilty very, very easily for things that are happening in the home. So a little one may feel guilty that mom and dad are not longer together. They might have that tendency to believe that things are their fault or that they did something wrong to cause the separation. So in those circumstances or in those instances, we recommend both parents to have conversation with the little one and say, we both love you, we both care for you, and we will do anything in our power to make you happy and to keep you happy.